Hey guys, welcome back to our repair guys. Today, great product review guys. Uh, we got LED bulbs for that uh, Honda Odyssey, okay, that we've been building on the channel, we know about it. We got LED bulbs for low and high beams. Okay, we wanna see how they perform, what they look like. Okay, that's the company. We have the link for the bulbs uh, in the description of the video. You can find their store if you, if you wanna get one yourself. Okay, that's what it comes with, warranty card, okay, and uh, email address if you if you want to contact them for something, if you have a problem. Uh, looks like a good company. Okay, this is the headlight bulb, uh, preferably never touch the LED part with your fingers, okay. And uh, we're going to go ahead and install it now and see, see how they're going to perform and how complicated the procedure will be but it looks like it's just plug and play both of them are pretty pretty simple design nothing complicated so let's see how they will look and perform on that on the odyssey now all right guys so in our case we'll need a few screwdriver just to remove the uh, to get the screws a little bit loose here for the bulb because otherwise sometimes you might not be able to remove the bulb Okay, those are original factory bulbs in that Honda. So we'll squeeze down there and pull the plug out. Okay, have to help it there a little bit because it's a little bit limited room in that vehicle. Okay, and actually the bulb will come out and then we'll pull the plug. Okay, so we can get our uh, second hand there. And don't touch the glass part of the bulbs with your fingers. If you do, make sure you clean it with alcohol and clean coat because the grease from the from your fingers will cause new bulbs to burn fast. Okay, this is the original low beam bulb, 9 HB4. Okay, right here it's 9006. Okay, so this is 9005. Okay, so we need this one right here now. 9006 okay also you can read it right here it says uh, okay you can find more information on 9006 here so let's go ahead and see how it's going to be feeding now there i'm super excited to see how they perform okay so we just turn it now clockwise about quarter revolution okay like that and we need to get the Okay, turn it a little bit. We need to get the three screws tight. And what is cool about, uh, especially about our Honda, is that the, the bulbs will stay cool because that's the fan in the back. And that way they will not get hot and uh, they will perform for a very long time. So let's go ahead, connect the wire now. Okay, it's supposed to be just plug and play, just like you're replacing a regular bulb. Okay, perfect. It's in, all the way. Now we will need to remove the battery so we can access better and uh, shoot the video for the high beam. If you're doing passenger side, you need to remove the power steering reservoir by just pulling it up, okay, and getting it out of the way like that, so you can reach. This is pretty simple, but we want to remove the battery, guys, so we can show you a little bit better uh, the replacement of the bulb, because otherwise it's practically impossible to get the camera there, as you can see. Okay, battery is out, and now we have here, okay, let me turn the light on way more room okay to reach the bulb which is located right there okay we got it out okay this is the bulb guys okay let's disconnect it now quick and it's stuck pretty good okay right there all right let's see what this one says now okay hb3u Okay, so this is the 905, 9005, which is this bulb. Okay, so we're going to connect it, install it, and see how they perform next. Alright guys, so we have the, uh, the bulbs installed now. Okay, I'm going to turn the lights in the shop, it's still daylight. 
So imagine how much better it's going to perform at night compared to even now. So let's see, really excited about it. Okay, let's turn them on. Okay, low beams work fine, high beams as well. So now let's check the pattern on low beams only. Okay, look at that, it's the same, the same pattern. People will say that you blind people. No, you will not. A well-designed boat will have the same pattern. That's high beams now. And it's pretty much close to the same high beams as well. Low beams, it's great. Okay, let me show you what it looks from here. Okay, and this is a regular boat. Okay, right there. You can check the difference, guys, yourself. Really, really good product. So, thank you guys for watching. Please subscribe and see you guys next time.